All right, it costs three dollars to come here. Three dollars per vehicle. Let's do it. Let's see if it'll even fit in the thing. It fits. It fits. There we go. Let's go. All right, guys, welcome back to the Sandman channel. Today, we're cruising out of GTM, the Guada Talamato, <laughs> Guada Talamato, Matanzas River. We do have a nine mile per hour winds coming at us in a northeast direction. We're taking the canoe out. It looks like we're gonna be paddling against the wind for a while. We're gonna hug the east bank, kind of try to stay out of the wind. Nick's over there contemplating what we're gonna do. I think that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna throw live shrimp and uh, let's just do it. Quit talking, let's go fish. Yeah, it hit, it hit like a good one. I didn't get it on camera, but Nick's rod just went like, that's the sound effect I'm using. Look at that, oh, that's a beautiful red. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. Look at that thing in the light. Booyah. Watch, it's like 16. <laughs> yeah, I did right at 16. Is it? Mm -hmm. About 16, not a keeper. Yep. And see, you, see you in a couple years, buddy. Boom. That was a pretty fish though. That was like one of the prettier redfish I've seen in a while. This is when we have a lot of wind coming through here. It's like 15 to 17 mile per hour gusts, I think. It's blowing in the wind. We got ourselves a redfish. Sometimes you gut hook them, and unfortunately, that's why these hooks rust out. So you cut, you cut your line, let the hook rust out, and uh, they'll be okay. They'll get over it. They have powerful, powerful stuff in here, crushing up shells, crushing up things. As soon as that thing starts to rust, take it right out. No problem. This is prime time, man. You get, like September and October, they just feed themselves so much because they're getting ready for that winter whenever it, uh, the water cools down. It's like they can sense it. They know it's about to get, the water's gonna get cold, so they get lethargic. So they gorge themselves like crazy. We go, the fishing's on fire this month and next month. Hey, Nick's on. It's gonna be like the Nick channel, man. You're always on. He's always on, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, trout! Yes, sir. First trout of the day. What are they gonna be? 15. Spotted sea trout. Need to be 15 inches long. This guy, oh, we're in the mud. I don't want him flapping mud all over me. This one is, uh, he's 15 and a half. He's a keeper. He's a keeper. And you can keep up to five of these guys. Nick, Nick wants them. We're gonna put them on the stringer. Good job, Nick. Did. This is an eighth ounce, eighth ounce, I can't talk right now. This is an eighth ounce jig head for the Fish Bites Fight Club series. And a live mullet. Versus an incoming tide. And hopefully a trout. This definitely feels like a trout. Yeah, it's running like a trout. It's it's head shaking. Keep him in the water. Keep him in the water. Put your rod tip up. Nah, I want to keep that taut. That's if he is it? There we go. No, definitely. Yeah, that's perfect. Right in the corner of their mouth. Boom! Another keeper sized trout. I'm gonna, I'm gonna measure it just for uh, just to be sure. We're at. 
15 uh, and a quarter. 15 and a quarter. It is a keeper size trout. I got a good, I got a good in here. This is a good trout. Wow. Let me get underneath you. Let me, let me get it. All right, we're doubled up. Nick, Nick and I are doubled up. Look at the size of this trout right here. Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, we doubled up. Oh, that one's on a cat. Dang. All right. Hell, time that bullet. This one's good. This one's 17 and a half. 17 and a half inches right there. Boom. Great catch. Cool. What was that on? A mullet? Yeah. Mullet with a jig head. Right there. All right. Well, you want to try that again? Yeah. Got ourselves a collection of mullet. Got some live shrimp. Yeah. That mullet just jumped out. There we go. These are good sized mullet to use right now. Got the mullet run running through, so these are perfect, perfect bait size. Uh, finger, finger length. Nick's on again. What you pulling in? Just like another rack. Another, another pompy drum. Spot with tea. <laughs> See you later, buddy. Yeah. All right, man. We. This is the spot right here on this point. You know what the difference is? The sun's up. The sun's up. Look how look how bright it is with the sun up now and then. Boom. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Yep. He's on. He's on. There you go, Nick. Maybe not. Nope. He's still on. He is still on. He was just swimming in. Oh, that's a that's a very tiny redfish. See you later, little dude. I'm gonna break off the tail here. Straight up through the meat. My beer can't have holes in them. Just lightly expose this hook right here. Right there. Yeah, if we catch a, a flounder now, that would give us the inshore slam. But we both have to catch a flounder in order to get that. Was that double slam? Grand slam? Slam I am? Double grand slam like Denny's. Double grand slam like Denny's. Are you, is your, do you have a flounder? I don't know. It's sucking on it like it could be. What do you think? You think he has a flounder? What? All right, one to a hundred. I say flounder is on at probably like 75%. Where are you at? Oh! Nick, are you at 100%? Maybe 88. It's going down to 88. I think, yeah. Stay tuned. Oh, here we go. Fish on. Meet your other trout. Oh, nice trout. Woo! Oh, yeah. Let's get it. Yeah, it's up here. It's got to be 15. Which one's it? Oh, my gosh. She's at 15. Nice. We'll make some fish, dude. Oh, yeah. Fish on. Fish on. If you can guess what it is, is it a trout, is it a redfish, or is it a flounder? Calling trout. He's calling trout, I'm calling redfish. What do you guys call at home? It's a cat. It's a catfish. We were all wrong, unless somebody, did you guess catfish? If you did, you're right. It's decent, whatever it is. It's swimming with the current. It's swimming in. Pulling redfish out? 
We are. Oh, tiny guy. Yeah, got ourselves a red. Let's put this rod down so I can do something with it. Dang, I hate when they do that. Sorry, buddy. Yep, we're gonna have to snap this one. That hook will rust out. And then... Yep. All right, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. Thanks so much for watching and subscribing. It doesn't cost you anything to subscribe. We do appreciate it. Also, man, that was a fun day. I had a fun day. Nick had a fun day. Uh, it's time to go get Dean. He gets out of school. Uh, so got to go do that. Uh, we'll see you on the next video. You guys keep it real. Sail, sail away. Sail away with me. Sail, sail.